Our world has become dominated by social media. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. These are today's platforms for social exchange and their influence over our collective mind is tremendous. What happens when this ecosystem is infiltrated by social bots, computer algorithms designed to mimic human behavior? Will we fall prey to manipulation, misinformation, and exploitation? Or can we develop effective bot detection programs before it is too late? Join us as we speak with Emilio Ferrara of the Information Sciences Institute at the University of Southern California. Social bots are designed for different purposes. Some bots are designed to be helpful, for example, customer service bots. Some bots are designed to be useful to people, but they can be manipulated. One recent example includes Thai, designed by Microsoft. And uh, more recently, we have observed several bots that are used for malicious purposes. For example, manipulating political discussion online uh, during uh, election periods, or manipulating the stock market one example from last year is about a company that deployed a, a army of social bots to increase the chatter uh, on social media about the company products and the stocks related to this company spiked, producing a $6 billion profit to the company. More recently, some bots are created for nefarious purposes, for example, for online political propaganda and the recruitment purposes. No one truly knows how many bots are already out there, and it is quite possible that what we are seeing is only the tip of the iceberg. Are we destined for a social media ecosystem that is dominated by bots rather than people? Or can detection methods outpace the increasingly sophisticated behavior of these parasites? So initially we used simple heuristics to detect bots, for example, by leveraging regularities in their activity patterns that were very different from real users. As the activity and behaviors of uh, bots become uh, more realistic, we need to infer new features that are predictive, and we are leveraging two different directions. One is deep learning, have machines uh, to tell us what are the predictive features uh, that we can infer. And also manually crafting features that are relevant and predictive of social bots or human behavior. Looking at multiple dimensions of the behavior, the content, the sentiment, the network structure and the activity patterns of the bots. Our primary goal right now is that of detecting bots that are performing malicious activities online or abusing social media. If you think of the bots as puppets, we would like to be able to identify the puppet masters, those behind the scenes who create and control the bots. And we would like to be able to reverse engineer their strategies, their tactics, and their final goals. Find out more in the review article, The Rise of Social Bots, in the July 2016 issue of Communications of the ACM.